In this recording, we're going to share with you the enhancements to Psi Capture with the latest release of 6.0. So you can see on the screen that we have this dark theme now, a little easier on the eyes. If you prefer the white theme, you can make those changes by going to the User Settings menu on the ribbon. I'm going to talk about the ribbon a little bit more here shortly, but let's go ahead and make that change from dark to light. So you can go back to the white version if you prefer. I am partial to the dark, so I'm going to shift back by going into that user settings again. I'm going to select the white, or excuse me, the dark at this point. I'm also going to talk about the quick access toolbar. Uh, we're going to talk a little bit more about that. I have that turned on. Uh, when I jump into a demonstration here, that'll make more sense. So let's go ahead and do that. We're going to kick off the capture process here. We're going to now select our capture profile. We used to call that a document type. Now that's capture profile. A little more uh, descriptive. Now once we do that, we're going to simulate a scan. We'll go ahead and bring some images in. Rather than selecting the scanner button that we used to have in 5.x, you now select the start capture button here at the top. But you'll see it's in two places. It's on the ribbon, so the ribbon has, has now replaced the application toolbar, and it's also on the quick start or the quick access toolbar at the top. So uh, that'll make more sense here at the end of this video. I'm going to show you a bit more about that. As so, you can see now we've scanned in our documents, and on the left hand side, you'll see that we have highlighted in blue the capture button. That's where we know what step of the workflow we're in. So let's go ahead and move forward now you'll see that the highlighted icon on the left is now the classification icon. That's how you know which module you're in in the step of the workflow. But you can also see at the bottom center of the screen, we have the workflow batch status bar, which also tells you where you're at. Very, very powerful. Now we're into the indexing step. Again, on the left, the indexing icon has uh, is highlighted. In the bottom, you can see the, the uh, workflow status and the uh, status bar there and now we're in quality assurance so new interface lots of changes you can see you're in QA in the status bar you can also see in your Q the quality assurance step on the left with the, the nice color popping out at you there um, the other thing I want to show you is you you can auto hide the navigation panel and we can turn the ribbon on and off so you can see I have the ribbon turned off I can just use my quick access toolbar and you can right click a menu item and add it to the toolbar. You can see navigation will fly out if you hover over it. And I can go back and show the ribbon as well. Very straightforward, gives you lots of real estate of the screen. The blue arrow has now been replaced with the home button. So you can see that as well. So we can go home. Well, this recording has given you a brief overview of what's new with SciCapture 6.0. We hope you've enjoyed it. To learn more, please contact your reseller or reach out to us at sales at SciGen.com. Thank you.